Hey everybody, it's me, Tom Angleberger. I'm here to show you a little craft project today. Um, so listen, uh, I didn't notice my hands are all inky. That's because I've been printmaking and that's what I'm gonna show you how to do today. You may also notice I've got poison ivy all over my face and I look weird, but what can you do? It's, uh, it's summer, it happens. All right, so listen, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna make a little Yoda print, okay? Now, normally I would show you how to do it out of a potato or something. Um, I'm not sure if I've got a potato. And plus, lately I've been enjoying using these blue things. This is the same stuff. Basically, this is like a eraser. It's just flatter and square and uh, allows me to allows me to make a little print really easily. Now watch how this works. Uh, first of all, I'm going to just show you what my drawing of Yoda is going to look like. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and draw on this with a pen. I'm not sure how that's going to work, but the thing wasn't showing up very well. Okay, so this is going to be a real simple drawing. This isn't going to be anything super fancy. Okay, just a nice little Yoda. I'm not sure if it's regular Yoda or origami Yoda. Looks kind of like origami Yoda. Okay, just a nice little. Yeah, I'm not sure if that was really needed. Yeah, I, I think I'll skip those little triangles. They didn't really add much to it and they'll just be complicated. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is cut out, I should have made this come down to the bottom, be one less cut, but let me show you how this works. I'm just gonna cut out my shape. Okay, now I'm gonna be real careful around this arm area here because if I cut that too close, it is going to, just fall off at some point. So I'm just gonna leave that big for right now. Okay, other than that, I can just go pretty loose with it here. Okay, there's that part off. See how this is working? Okay, I love this stuff. It is so great. I, I think if, you, if you're making a linoleum block print, you can actually cut it out with a saw or something, but you know, this is so much fun and it's so flexible. It makes it really uh, easy for me to do. Okay, now I do wanna work on this hand area a little bit. I'm just gonna clip a triangle out of here that goes along the ear. I really don't wanna mess around with, get too close to that hand though. I'm gonna actually carve that away, um, carve that away with this. So this is my uh, little uh, carver thing here. It's got a little V, it's hard to see in the picture here. It's got a little V there, and the V is just gonna let me go in there and make lines or cut out big chunks as needed. Okay, so I'm basically just cutting away the, the parts that I don't want there of that hand. Okay. Okay, around the ear there. Okay, there you go. And this ear got a little too big too, so I'm gonna carve out around that. I don't want this just to be straight lines. I want it to be nice and wiggly, like Yoda himself. Okay, there we go. All right, now, um, the hand here is gonna be green, so we're not gonna carve that out. Okay, so, so and the same thing here, we're gonna carve around that hand, and we're gonna carve a the line here for the cloak too. So I'm just gonna start down here at the bottom. I'm gonna draw this line up and stop it right there. And then the hand will go here. One, two, just scooping out the area between the fingers. 
and later I will come back and touch it up as needed. Now I want to scoop out all the area inside this row, but I want to make sure I'm leaving a nice border, otherwise it just won't even print the edge of the robe. Okay, scooping out all the stuff inside. I'm going to take my glasses off if I want to get a better look at this here. Let's see here. I guess I could do okay. All right, now I'm going to draw another, I'm going to leave a little space. I'm going to draw a line up on this side. I hope I lift enough of a line. Now I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to out, do the outline of this whole thing. And remember, I'm not going all the way to the edge. I'm leaving a line that's going to print. Okay. There we go. And now this, all this interior needs to be scooped out. Can actually do that fairly quickly. And it's going to be okay if some little parts of it don't get scooped out because that's what makes print make it, a lot of prints really beautiful is having a little bit of extra, uh, having these little unexpected and unplanned lines. <laughs> This is not the most exciting part of the video. Yeah. Sides. Okay. All right. So I really didn't spend enough time thinking this whole thing through. We're going to have to see how it all turns out. I'm not really sure how it's going to turn out. So um, he's got his robe and his hands. Okay. So here's a problem. The, ins the part of his robe that's on his sleeve is going to have to get carved out. Oh, boy. Yikes, I don't know how that's going to go. Okay, now let's see. We want him, his eyes will be white with pupils in the center. Okay, so we're going to leave an area in the center there. Same thing here. And leave an area in the center for his pupil. Okay, I think I will draw a little... Um, a little triangle, cut out a little triangle here on the ear just to give something over there. More lines and um, I can give him a little mouth here. I think it might look good if his mouth is open like he's saying something and then I can use this little stamp maybe with a speech balloon to have you to say hi to people. All right, well, I don't know if it's going to be great, but let's see how it is. We'll just print one real quick and see what it looks like. You ready?